Hey folks, how you doing? This is Mahesh. So, Microsoft Corporation recently has released a Windows HDR calibration tool. So let's check it out. This app lets you calibrate your HDR display to optimize it for games, HDR games, including Auto HDR and other HDR content on Windows 11 PC. So since I got the latest Windows 11 update 22HD, I figured I'd put this, stick this in, see if it improves my um, displays with HDR capability. So, let's check it out. So this uh, HDR calibration tool is only available on the Microsoft Store. Uh, it doesn't get bundled with the uh, Windows Update, which is pretty weird. Uh, so let's open this up, and here it is. Optimize your display for HDR content, so the HDR games, blah, blah, blah. So before you get started, move this window to the HDR display you want to calibrate. So it's in the display. Make sure it's use HDR is turned on in display settings. Uh, I have to turn that on. Go here, display settings. I turn on, use HDR. And boom. Uh, so how to use, when using the three patterns, drag the slider until the pattern is no longer visible on each screen. So it depends on these patterns, these uh, cross patterns. So you got to drag the slider, move the slider till these patterns completely disappear. Simple as that. Let's get started. Minimum luminance. This calibration determines determines the darkest visible details on your display. So there's a typo here. It seems like Microsoft, the guy who writes this stuff, is a pair here, so a new it, Get a higher new guy. So determines has been written two, twice here. Fucking weird. Yeah, let's get out of this. So you got to make. Uh, you got to adjust the slider till this crosses completely disappear. And boom, that's it. Same here. It's just a slider till the crosses disappear completely. Boom. There you go. Max full frame luminance test. Same with this. Alright, for some reason my mouse pointer is stuck. Some kind of bug. Alright, it's working. Well, it's very slow, it's lagging a lot, the mouse pointer. No idea why. Alright, that's better. Well, she's lagging here as well. So, color saturation. Adjust the slider below. Determine how color appears on your display for both HDR and SDR content. More natural, more saturated, and vivid. Alright, let's check this out. Well, she's already stuck. So between the highest and the lowest, there's hardly any difference in the color. Uh, so I'll stick it in the middle and be done. I review and save your new color settings. So if you're happy with the calibration, enter name, create a profile, and boom, boom. All right. And finish. Alrighty, and here's the new color profile HDR. You can enable it anytime by selecting display and pull down the color profile, pull down menu. You use HDR, use HDR on off. Yeah, colors are much better now. HDR colors are much better. I think I'm going to keep this and, uh, and run with it. 
So it looks like Microsoft has finally made something useful for Windows HDR because the display looks much better now after calibration. So thanks for watching. See you guys later.